Well, it's a classic whodunit murder mystery. The Port Arthur Little Theater presents Agatha Christie's Murder on Nile. Tom Wright joins us from the theater with more. Tom? Angela Kelly, of course, Agatha Christie, probably being the master of the murder mystery and uh, known for that. And, and uh, this is uh, one of her plays as well. And with us is Janet Lene, the director of the show. And uh, of course, set, uh, you know, the, the title kind of gives it away. Set on the Nile, a steamboat going up the Nile. Um, and there's some along, somewhere along the way, we're going to have a murder in this. Mm, a couple. A couple. <laughs> okay, a little body count going on. Uh, what attracted you to the show? What did you like about I, it? I'd actually done it years ago for another theater, and uh, I just loved it. I just love doing the murder mysteries. We don't do enough of it in the area and I wanted to bring it back. Now I know some of you know Agatha Christie stuff can be well known people have seen it and if you kind of know already what happens is that ruin it for you? I don't think so because it's done differently every time. Yeah. Cool. We have different styles and well, we're going to give a little taste of it. Let's set the scene up. I know sometimes these can be a little complicated in terms of plot, but what, what can we say to kind of clue the viewer in what we're about to see? Okay, well, what happens here is uh, Kay is talking to Canon Penny, Pennyfather about the persecution of Jackie. Jackie was the fiance of her now husband. Okay. Uh, and so she's trying to talk the canon into making Jackie stop. Okay. Pretty well, much stalking her. All right. Uh, let's take a look at a scene from Murder on the Nile. Uncle Ambrose, you've got to help me. In what way? Jackie is making herself utterly ridiculous. Uh, Simon's told you about this, this incredible persecution, but it's got to be stopped. You've got to stop it. Indeed. And how do you suggest I go about it? Uh, talk to her. Uh, show her what a fool she's making of herself. Threaten her. Tell her we shall take proceedings. She has a perfect right to travel on this boat, Kay. Uh, then appeal to her. Appeal to her. Her pride, her dignity. Uh, show her how undignified it is to go running after a man who doesn't want her. What makes you believe she will listen to me? People do listen to you. You've got something about you that makes them listen. I am to appeal, am I, to her better nature? Yes. Get her to give up this silly persecution. Why do you mind so much, Kay? Oh, wouldn't anybody? It's maddening. I simply can't stand it. But you'll have to stand it, won't you? What do you mean? That, that there isn't a way out. You could bear this thing well, or you could bear it badly. But you cannot, you cannot deny a thing that, 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 that exists and that you cannot alter. When we get to Wadi Hafa, I'll... Charter an aeroplane. We'll fly right off into the wild. Fugitives! Uh, come and sit down, Kay. What are you running away from? But you know. Oh, yes, I know. I'm waiting for you to face back. And Murder on the Nile opening this weekend, running for the next three weekends here at the Port Arthur Little Theater. If you like a good mystery, this is where you need to be. Come see it, Kelly. Thanks, Tom.